Hello, hello, guys. Hello. Good evening. Hello, hello. Good evening. Hello, Marita. How are you? How are you today? Mm -hmm. Are you excellent? Are you very are you, good? Very good. Okay. Are you feeling great today? Okay. Cool. Excellent. Uh, let's see, Edwin. Hello, Candy. Monica, Mabel. Hello, teacher. Hello. How is it going at this moment? How is it going at this moment? How are you doing, guys? Okay. Um, I hope you're doing great. We are going to see uh, our class 14. Imagine. Class 14. Let's see. Carlos Dominguez, Josman, welcome. Okay. Welcome, guys. Thank you. Thank you, teacher. Okay. My pleasure. Good evening. Good evening, Josman. Okay. Um, no rain, right? No rain today. It's not raining, right? No rain? No, today it's not raining. Okay, it's we have a clear, a clear night. Okay, that is great because rain interrupts many of the times the class. Okay, perfect. Okay. Great guys. Very good. Okay, before we start with the class, before we start, let me remind you, let me remind you. Um, you need to complete the platform which day, which day? You need to complete the platform. For what day? Do you know? Do you remember? The platform, the assignments and the exercises. Yes, teacher. Uh -huh. But for when? When is the date that you need to finish? When is the date? That you need to finish I am, when? I am, I am finished. Um, okay, okay. I will give you that info information. Okay. Uh, are you seeing the screen? Yes. The monitor. Yes. Okay. Perfect. Okay. The platform and the assignments. You need to complete, you have to finish, to finish all of all the assignments in the final exam by Thursday, okay? By Thursday, next, next Thursday of this week, because that is, that is a date that is being given. La fecha que es, se está dando, okay? By Thursday. All right. Yes. Understood. Questions or doubts? You need to complete, finish the assignment in the final exam by this day, by Thursday, 20, 28. All right. All right. Is that clear? All right. Okay. Perfect. Okay. Perfect. I hope okay. you have you have been advancing with the platform with exercises, or if you finish, or if you finish already, that is even better. 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 Mejor. Better. Better. Okay. Uh, let's see how many are we. In? Ah, we are fourteen people. Fourteen. Okay. Great. Excellent. Today we have. Class number 14. Okay, we are going to start with a class right away so we can take advantage of the time that we have. Okay, what, what number class is the one that we have on the screen? Class number... What class number is it? 14. Class 14, thank you, thank you very much. Class 14, correct. Okay, tomorrow is the penultimate class 
And Thursday, we finish. We finish the model. Imagine. July, sorry. Bye bye. Okay, let's see. Let's go directly with the topic. We need to pass this over. Okay. Okay, verb to be. Class of today is about simple past. Simple past, but the normal simple verb past to be is simple past. Ah, about the verb to be. Okay, great. The refreshment that we are going to be doing is about the simple past. Okay, that is today's topic. And the question is. Did you like, Did chocolate? You like chocolate? Uh, chocolate is chocolate. Spanish. What is chocolate. the word? Chocolate. Uh, okay, repeat, repeat the word. This word is not so do, simple. Do you like chocolate? Did you like chocolate? Uh, chocolate. Chocolate. Repeat chocolate. 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 Uh -huh. That is the pronunciation. Chocolate. Do you like chocolate? Uh, yeah. Yeah, I do. I, I have... I have some, I have some chocolate in the mini, in the mini fridge that I have here at home. And you, do you like chocolate, guys, in general? Yes, I do. I love it. You do, you love chocolate candy, but what type? We have many types of chocolate. What type of cho chocolate do you like, candy? It's... Chocolate, um, but it's sometimes. Ah, okay, okay. In English? <laughs> okay. I sometimes, you can use adverse, adverse of frequency. I sometimes. Uh -huh. What is next? Okay, I will help you out. I will help uh, you out with that. Uh -huh. Correct. Subject, remember. Subject. Verb and the complement. Okay, I have the document. I is the subject. I. Other frequency? I sometimes. I sometimes. And verb, what is the verb? What is the verb? Drink. Maybe. Uh, drink. <laughs> Let's see, do you drink uh, chocolate? Mm. Uh, no, it's not drink. It's not like. drink. Is? No. Uh huh. Okay, what is next? I sometimes like chocolate. Like, okay, you can say I sometimes like chocolate. Correct, chocolate. Or chocolate. you you can you can change the subject by using by using it. I sometimes. Can you repeat it? I sometimes like it. Ah, okay. But all what you said in Spanish is this. Todo lo que dije en español is this. Imagine Spanish, this. English, it reduces a lot. Okay. And what about you, uh, Eulise? Do you like chocolate? You don't like it? What type of chocolate? Okay. Uh, I don't like chocolate. Any any type, any type uh, of chocolate. Uh, uh, maybe a little bit. Uh -huh, okay, okay, a little bit. Okay, great. And Marcela, okay, guys, you can you can participate. Remember that this class is about participating, so you can improve. Uh huh. Do you like chocolate? You don't like it. You prefer candies or what else? Okay, Mats. Uh huh. Uh huh. Open like question. You like what? What type? We have many, many types of chocolate. What I type? Like the dark, dark chocolate. And I dislike the white chocolate. Ah, you don't like uh, white chocolate. Ah, okay, I see. Interesting. Okay, I, yeah, I don't feel white chocolate as chocolate. I don't know why, but no, I don't. Carlos and you? Carlos Dominguez? Do you like chocolate? You don't? I, 
I often like it. I often like it. Ah, okay. Hmm? I like it for breakfast. Ah, but you mean uh, liquid chocolate for breakfast. Right, Karen? In the desayuno. Me gusta ah. chocolate en el desayuno. I ah. like I like chocolate. Chocolate, chocolate is ah. for, breakfast. for breakfast. Correct. I like chocolate for breakfast correct that is in english perfect perfect okay but um liquid right liquid chocolate liquid for drinking in a cup okay what about in bars in bars do you like chocolate in bars like this uh-huh no so, yes. so okay i like it i like it in yes, more I like. yes, yes i like I it like. yes i like it don't forget the subject because this this is chocolate this replaces all the word chocolate okay yes i i sometimes like it yes i like it with no other frequency yes huh yes i like it okay perfect uh, some of you like it Next question. Can you read the question? What's your favorite brand? Um, if you if you ask me, my favorite chocolate brand would be um, Hershey's. I like Hershey's chocolate. I like Hershey too. Ah, okay. Who said it? Ah, okay. Ingrid, you like Hershey's too. Ferrero um, Rocher. And which ones? Ferrero Rocher. Uh, I have not, I have not tasted that chocolate. I don't know the brand. What is brand? What does it mean brand? What is the meaning of brand? Mark. Correct. Yes. If you see, I am showing this brand of chocolate. Okay. And what about you guys and the rest? Uh, Monica, Edwin, Nada. What is your favorite brand of chocolate? Don't you have any preference in brand? Chocolate brand, brand. Karen Villegas, yes, Edwin. So I like the chocolate, uh, however. Uh, what, is, what is that brand? I don't know the brand. Bonobon. Ah, oh, Bonobon, those are Colombian chocolates. Aren't they? Yes, Colombian. Yeah, bueno, bon. I guess so. Creo que sí, I guess so. Okay, and can you mention any other brand? Chocolate brand? My favorite brand in Hershey is um, Ferrero Rocher. Ah, okay. Are those expensive, right? Yes? Kind of, a little bit. Okay, kind of expensive. Okay, and Josman, do you like chocolate? What's your favorite brand? <laughs> My favorite chocolate brand is uh, Kiss. Oh, Kisses. Okay, the, the small one. Yes. Uh, or the yeah. big Kiss. The big Kiss that is this size. <laughs> this is a big Kiss. Uh -huh. Very big. Okay. I have seen them. Okay, great. The Kisses are, are delicious, but I feel them too sweet. Too sweet for me. Um, what I mean is too? What is too? Too sweet. What is two, two, correct. If you have the word, if you have this word before an adjective, before is demasiado. Okay. Very good. Okay. Yeah. Kisses are too sweet for me. Okay. Perfect. Uh, let's see what else about, what else we have about chocolate. Okay. And this opportunity, we have a listening and a reading. And if you want, we can practice some pronunciations. Okay, we have a reading and listening activity. Okay, what do you see in the picture? What do you see? Cacao. What do you see? Ah, okay, <laughs> perfect. Yeah, we are talking about cacao, <laughs> correct? But in, in this one, what is this? 
Uh, cacao, cacao uh -huh, but no, is is ground. It's like yeah. ground. Okay, vocabulary. Get ready for vocabulary. Okay, ground. What is ground? Okay, when you see powder. Okay, when you see powder, polvo, powder. Okay, ground is. Molido. Yeah. Okay. So that is. Ground, uh huh. Ground, no, it's not ground. Chocolate is the word that you said before. The word that you said before is ground cacao. Cacao, but cacao is that in in English or in Spanish? <laughs> okay, <laughs> mm, we'll find out. Then we'll find out. Vamos a ver what. Okay, we'll find out. Okay, perfect. And those ones, what is this picture? Empanadas, maybe? <laughs> cacao. No. No, right? No. <laughs> they look no. like. They look like, para decir, se parecen o parecen. They look like. You can say, ah, teacher, they. Why they? Why they, guys? Uh -huh. Why they? Because are plural. Are... Because, mm -hmm. correct. They are plural. Okay, we have one, mm -hmm. two, three. And how many? How many? Seven. 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 Okay. Seven things. Siete cosas ahí. Seven cacao things. Okay. But we are going to learn vocabulary. This opportunity. Okay. They look like. Parecen. They look like empanadas, but they are not empanadas. Okay. Perfect. Perfect. Okay. Cacao. Let's see. I will, I have opened uh, already the link. This is the link. And the activity is this one. Um, okay, just uh, one moment. Um, I got the browser. Okay, and this is, this is the one. Okay, chocolate, repeat chocolate. Chocolate. Okay, chocolate. Okay, pronunciation. Chocolate. I wanna check chocolate, correct, chocolate. Okay, and this is the picture. Chocolate. Look at uh -huh, chocolate, correct? Look at the picture. Does that do they look like a cacao? Cacao beans. Ah, okay. Semillas de cacao. How do you say semillas de cacao in English? Cacao. Cacao? No. Beans. No. And what is beans? What is beans by itself? The word by itself. Como frijoles. Uh, but uh, but only beans, yes. Only beans, yes. But cacao beans is together, the two words. Semillas de cacao. Yes. Okay, semillas de cacao. Okay. Hey, teacher, are you right? That is cacao beans. Okay. Are you right? Estás seguro que sí? Yes. We'll find out. Okay, perfect. Um, Let's see. Uh, volunteer for this part. Uh, Mabel, Mabel, is, is Mabel in class? Yes. Yes, Mabel, thank you. Uh, please help me with the reading of this part. Okay. What do you know about chocolate? Learn about the history of chocolate and the interesting journey mm -hmm. um, from? from from cocoa being to chocolate bar 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 it's like like the place like the place where you drink bar bar okay do do the preparation that's freeze then read the article and do the ex ex exercise Sorry. Exercises, it's plural, exercises. Exercises. Okay, perfect, perfect. Journey, repeat journey. Journey, what is journey? Journey, journey do you know the word? Journey, do you know it? What is journey? Mm -hmm. uh -huh. No, no idea. Okay, let's see. Journey is? Come on. Like a trip. It's like a trip, okay? This is another word for trip, journey. Okay, perfect. Uh, let's see. We are going to listen uh, in this part 
Ah, but before that, before the listening, let's do the preparation. I almost uh, forgot. Uh, match, match, match. Uh, guys, hello, hello. What match is the word, uh -huh. the word with the, the word with the definition? With the definitions, okay. First definition, the first definition is. It contains, it contains the cocoa beans. The, the cocoa okay. beans. It contains the real cocoa beans. If you look at the picture, okay, this the structure that you see. This is structure. What is the word for that definition? What is the word? It contains the cocoa beans. To heat, to ferment, to melt, a shell, to cool, a pod, okay, to grind or pulp. What is the correct word? A shell. A pulp. shell. Uh, what is a shell? Uh, que no es como una concha. Ah, okay, perfect. Shell, okay. Shell, caparazón, concha, etc. Okay, cáscara, etc. Ah, okay, good. And do you think so? Cre? Do you think so? That is shell? You can say yes, teacher, I think so, or no, I don't think so, in negative. Okay, but if you if you say it, I will leave it like that. La dejo así. Okay, next. Next uh, definition. Any of you? Hello, hello. Any? Any, any he in the is, class? Uh, he he is is nice. Nice. Ah, okay. It is? It is? It okay. is a skin around the beans. It is a skin around the beans. Ah, okay. It is like a skin. And the word? What do you think so? What is that? A skin. Uh, do you know mamones, right? The fruit, mamones, yes? Yes. Okay, mamones, they have like a skin around, okay, around the, the mini bolita, okay, or the chibola in Spanish. Uh -huh, it's like a, a thin skin. Okay, what is that? What is the word? A uh, pot. A uh, pot, okay, let's see, what is a pot? Pod, okay, pod is, oh, pod is vaina, pod in Spanish. So you think it's a pod, the, the, the skin? Yes, no? Yes, yes, yes. You agree, okay, you agree. It's an acuerdo, you agree, okay. Um, I agree. You agree, okay, perfect. Next. It protects the beans. It protects, uh, we are talking about protection. It protects the beans, mm, but in this case, what is the word, guys? What do you think? What's the word? Uh, mm -hmm. Ideas? Okay, it protects, it protects the, the beans, it protects them. Nope. Okay, we can leave it for a moment. Leave it for a moment and we'll check this one too. Okay. To make, to make something, something hot. Something hot. Okay, to make something hot. What is the word? To Like water, for example, if you're going to prepare some coffee. To make something hot, what is that? To cool? To, no, to cool is the opposite. When you oh. are going to drink a soda, you want it very cold and not hot. Cold is, to cool is the opposite from, from? What is the word? Uh -huh. Calentar in English? No, no ideas? Oh. Calentar is? Uh, you can say to warm, but in this case is to, uh -huh. to melt, to, get, to melt. Yeah, to get. This one Man. is to heat. Uh, 
to hear. To hear. hear. Okay, uh -huh. that is to make. Can you read it? Mm -hmm. to, to make something hot. Okay, to make something hot. And this one, what, do you, what about this definition? To make something cold. To make something cold, uh, and that is? Frio. Uh -huh, but to make it, hacerlo. Frio. What's, it, what's the word? To ferment. Uh, to ferment. Nope. It's not to that cool. one. To cool. What is cool? Hey, you are you are very cool, guys. You are known. That is not is not that cool. We aren't talking about the verb. Cool. What is cool? Fresco. Verb. Uh, but the verb, the verb is verb. We have adjective and we have we have the verb is. The verb, el verbo. Okay, nope. Helar, congelar. Okay, that is the definition. And this one, what is this one? I know it's already done, just a uh, To make something, ah, oh, I placed it in the wrong place. Okay, let me correct it to make. Mm -hmm. Something cold. To make something cold is to cool. To cool. Okay, cool. and this one, can you read it? Read the definition, please, Carolina Elizabeth. Okay, no. One, two, three, Renee, maybe. Hi. To turn something solid into liquid. Uh, okay, to turn something solid into liquid, for example, butter, when you heat it, butter, melt. is to melt. melt, what is melt? Derretir, fundir. Uh, correct, yes, okay, correct word and correct definition. Okay, nice, thank you. Next, uh, the participant, Eulise, next. Hi, uh, to break something into very small piece, pieces. 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 What is that? To make something into very small, small pieces. Mm. To green. I don't know. <laughs> uh, green. Okay, let's see. Pronunciation is. Grind. Grind. Uh, grind. Okay. Grind. 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 Grind, to grind, okay, that is correct. To grind goes here. Okay, for example, if when you grind the corn, for example, when you grind corn or coffee using a special stones. Okay, great. And the final one, the final definition, um, judgment, judgment, final definition. To cause uh, chemical change in plants. Okay, perfect. To cause a chemical, repeat chemical. Chemical. Change. Change. In plants. Okay, and the word is? To ferment. To ferment, ferment. or ferment. Okay, let's see. I will place it there. Okay, and the final the final word that is there is what pool. is pulp? Oh. What is pulp? Mm, I don't know. Okay, we can leave it in this space because that is the last one. Okay, I will click on finish. And we will check. Mm -hmm, finish. Oh, okay. Total score is six out of eight. Two incorrect. Okay, they were two incorrect. Okay. This is the opposite. Okay, it contains the cocoa beans. 
a pod in uh -huh. it is a skin around the beans around the beans is a shell a shell okay i guess because all of the rest the rest are correct okay the rest are correct but only those two were incorrect but not bad not bad not too mal. not bad okay perfect okay let's see I will play the listening part by part. You just listen and follow follow the reading. Siga la lectura with the listening. Um, okay, I will do something in this case. Let's see. Let me pass the listening here. Okay, the first one is this one. Okay, ready? Are you ready? Yes? Yes, yes, yes. Okay, okay, perfect, perfect. After after the listening and the reading, we will complete those activities that are in this place. Okay. Chocolate. What do you know about chocolate? Learn about the history of chocolate and the interesting journey from Cocoa Ben to Chocolate Bar. World Chocolate Day Did you know that there's a World Chocolate Day? It takes place each year on 7th July. To celebrate it, read about the history of chocolate and the interesting journey from Cocoa Ben to Chocolate Bar. Okay, do you did you know that guys that there is a chocolate day? Did you know, Sabia? Did you in simple past? Did you know? I didn't know. You didn't know, but if you like chocolate, if you like it, uh huh. Okay. When is when is the date? When is it? According with this. Seven. Uh. Okay. It takes. Ah. Uh, it says. Can you read it? It takes place. It. It's year. Seven July. On 7th, ah, okay, this month, at the beginning, the first week. Uh, okay, 7th, ah, it was, when was it? When was it? When was it? What day? When was it? Subject. Tuesday. Subject, very compliment. When was it? When was it? Uh -huh. When was it? Yeah. Subject, remember, subject, very compliment. Huh? Mm, no, what what day? Uh, Tuesday, Sunday, according with the calendar. It's Wednesday. Wednesday. Okay, but uh -huh, subject, very compliment is it? It was. It was. It was on Thursday. On, on Thursday, okay. El jueves. Thursday, okay, like three weeks ago three weeks ago, okay? And it says celebrated, et cetera, et cetera, et cetera, cocoa, okay. It's not cacao, see? It doesn't say cacao. In English, is Cocoa. Cocoa. Cocoa, cocoa, bean. cocoa bean, correct, cocoa bean. Okay, let's listen this, uh, this other paragraph, okay? Your attention, please. A Brief History of Chocolate Chocolate was first used as a drink over 3,500 years ago in Central America. It was very popular with the Mayans and the Aztecs, who mixed cocoa beans with vanilla or chili peppers. In fact, cocoa beans were so important to them that they were used as money. Cocoa was first grown in Ecuador, which was, for a long time, the world's number one producer of cocoa beans. It is still one of the top 10 producers of the beans, but nowadays more than 70% of cocoa beans come from West Africa.
Okay, good details, right? Okay, what are the important details in this paragraph? Important details, can you say them? Important details in this paragraph? Said the cocoa bean was used like money. Ah, okay, it was used, used with D at the end. Okay, mm -hmm. remember, uh, simple, simple past, uh, regular, regular verbs. You said no is used uh, D. Okay, can you try? Try it, try it. Used. 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 Okay. Used. Okay, it was used as money. Okay, that is uh, one detail. Okay, another important detail that you can see or mention in this paragraph. Only one detail. No. Ecuador was the number one producer. Uh, what what country was the number one producer of cocoa beans? Ecuador. Ecuador. It there it is. Ecuador. Okay. Very good. And if you check where to be in simple past, see they were used. Fueron usados. They were used. Okay. Good. Okay, only two, two details, two important details. Okay, no problem. Let's continue with the next paragraph. Okay, let's listen. Uh, let's see. Um, we are in this part. Cocoa beans. Cocoa beans come from cocoa trees. These trees grow in tropical forests around the world, from South America to Indonesia. The beans grow in colorful pots of red, yellow, and purple. Inside the pots are the beans. Each tree grows around 50 pots a year, and each pot can contain between 20 and 60 beans. It takes around 100 beans to make 100 grams of chocolate. The pots are picked by hand to protect the trees. Okay, one important detail in this paragraph. One, only one, one important detail. Any, any of you? The beans grow in color, colorful. Ah, oh, okay, what colors, what colors? Okay, look at the picture. Okay. Red, yellow, and purple. Okay, red, yellow, they can be red. And even you can see these ones, what is that color? Orange. Orange, They those two are orange. Imagine, they are very different. They are different, okay, good. They are from different colors. Okay, very good. Let's continue with the next, with this paragraph, this one. Okay, um, silence, uh, microphones, deactivate your microphones. Thank you. Okay. Okay, okay microphones, guys, turn the mm -hmm. microphone off. Uh, Carlos, you have the microphone activated. Carlos, Carlos, okay. Okay, I will mute. Okay, ready for the next paragraph. preparing the bins. Once the pots are picked from the tree, they are opened and the bins are taken out. The bins need to go through a number of different processes before they are ready to be turned into chocolate. First, the bins and the pulp are placed in a special boxes where they slowly ferment for up to five days. Here the beans turn brown and start to develop their special flavor. They are then put out in the sun to dry for approximately 14 days. After this, they are roasted for about 15 minutes in preparation for the final stage when the beans are taken out of their shells. 
At the end of this process, we are left with the cocoa nibs, chocolate in its purest form and the basic ingredient for all chocolate products. Okay, okay. It's in this part is talking about the process to become. Become, what is become? The verb. Become, what is the verb? Llegar a ser. Llegar. Convertir. Convertirse. Convertir. Okay, convertir, transform. Transform, you can use some verbs. Transform, become, uh, prepare. For example, if you are cooking something, okay, in a, in a way, you can use prepare. See, you can use different verbs. Okay, it's talking about that. How to prepare the uh, cocoa beans into chocolate. Okay, any special detail that you want to mention? A special detail in this part? Maybe the beans turn brown and start to develop their special flavor. Ah, okay, when you do what? When you do what? Cuando hace que? When you? Dry or? Roast. Roast. What is roast? Roasted, the word. What is roasted? Rostado. Rostizado. No, like chicken. Uh, no, that is a chicken. Roasted chicken. Rostizado. But we are talking about cocoa beans. So, I had to style. Okay. Correct. Yes. Yeah. That is... That is correct. But how many days do you do you do that? How many days? Um, fear the beans and the pool are placed in the special boxes. Mm -hmm. Okay, the special boxes where they slowly ferment for up to for five days. Five days. Okay, only five days, no more. And then you have more days for more processes. Okay, good. Let's see. Let's continue with the next uh, paragraph. From cocoa nibs to chocolate liquor. The first step is to grind the nibs by machine or between two large stones. This produces cocoa liquor, a semi-solid paste. This is then cooked and mixed continuously for hours or even days until it is just right. This is also the stage at which other ingredients are added. Sugar, milk, various flavors. Interestingly, chocolate melts at 34 degrees centigrade. This is just below body temperature, which explains why it can be so sticky and messy but also why it melts as soon as you put it in your mouth. Okay, important detail in this one, important detail. Hello, hello. Any detail? Chocolate melt at 34 agree. Uh, no, uh, degree. Uh, 34. Great. Okay, that symbol is great. Okay, centigrade. Centigrade is letter C. Okay, centigrade. Uh, okay, and what is that? This is just hmm? below body tempera temperature. I don't have an idea. Uh, how it okay, is. okay. In the reading, okay. I will send you. I will upload the, the listening. The listening part for you to listen the pronunciation, okay? When you have time, but the word is temperature, repeat. Temperature. Temperature. Temperature, okay, okay, good. Below body, below body temperature, even below. Okay, great, that is a good detail about cocoa beans. And uh, let's see, do we have more? Ah, yeah, we got. We got more. Okay, let's listen. And this is the, the last uh, paragraph. From liquid to solid. At this point, the cocoa nibs are ready for the last stage in the journey. For the cocoa liquor to turn into solid chocolate, 
It needs to be heated and cooled and heated again until it forms a solid mass. And so, at last, the journey from Ben to Bar is complete. So, now you know all about ch how chocolate is made. You may want to celebrate the day by eating one of your favorite chocolate treats. Okay, chocolate. that was it. Okay, that was it. Good. No details in this part, yes? This is the final, final process of the cocoa beans. Okay, let's do some exercises. Task one, what is, what is the instruction there? Instruction, what is the instruction? Put. Hello, hello, any, any of you? Put the stage no. in the perfect order. Uh, a stage, okay, if you, when you say only a stage, that is singular. This is plural, it's stages. Stages. Stages, okay, put the stages in the correct order. Okay, what is first? When you are preparing a chocolate, what is the first stage or the first process? What is first? Uh, they take food take from, the tree. from the tree. Okay, okay. It's already in the first place. Next. What is next? Next process. Uh, okay, this one, number three, you say. Number two. Ah, okay. Mm, but uh, let's see. Mm, this one. In number two, like that? Yes. Okay, yes. like that, okay, I see, okay. Next, next process. Adding other ingredients, drying the beans in the sun, roasting the beans or grinding the beans. Roasting the beans. Roasting, mm, okay. Okay, as right. number... Number three. Okay. Okay, we can leave it like that. There is no problem. Or if you see, or if you say that is different. Right. 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 The beans, right. The beans in the sun. In the sun. Okay. Dry, dry in the beans in the sun. Mm, okay. Okay. Next. What is next? Roasting the uh, this one that that is that the next process. Yeah. Okay, it's already there. I don't touch it. Okay, next. Okay, we are in this part. And what is next? Next process. Adding other ingredients or grinding the beans. Hello, hello. Grinding the beans. Grinding, okay. I will place grinding in this part. And finally. Grinding other ingredients. Adding other ingredients. Other ingredients, repeat ingredients. 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 Okay. Ingredients. Okay. Prepare, prepare because I will click and finish and we will see. Dun, 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 dun. Okay. Let's see how good you did. Oh, excellent. That was a complete process. Very good. All of them correct. 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 All of them. Okay. Congrats. Okay. Good. Now you can make chocolate. Go to Ecuador and get some cocoa beans, and you are prepared uh, to make some chocolate. Okay, excellent, good. And do we have any task? Okay, we have task number two. Uh, what is the indication in this one, in number two? Choose the best answer. Choose the best answer, okay. The Beans grow in trees. 
Okay, the beans. Okay, that is the first word. Beans, we have pots and we have barns. What is the correct word? We have. What is the correct word? Pots. Pots, okay. Pots or beans? Okay. Or pots. beans. Pots. 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 Okay, next. Okay, next. Can you read it? The tree grow. Can you read it? The trees grow. Trees grow. In the tropics. The tropics. In the tropics. Okay, you say in the tropics. Okay, I will select that one. In the tropics. Okay, the next one. Okay, the next one. Okay, there is a microphone in the background. Check. There is a microphone in the background. Check. Okay, Maritza, the microphone is causing. Your microphone is causing. Thank you. Thank you. Okay, next is. Next sentence. Mats cocoa beans are grown in Ecuador. Where? Where? What place? West Africa. West Africa. Are you sure? Yes. Or Ghana. Ghana in the reading. The listening, I don't remember. West Africa. West. Okay, West Africa. Okay, I can select it. Let's see the next one. Okay, the beans are roasted for 15 minutes. 15 minutes. 15 minutes. 15 minutes. Okay, if you say yes. that, okay, perfect. If you are completely sure, that is the importance of the listening because when you listen several times, okay, uh, you remember details. Okay, 15 minutes. Uh, next one, the purest. The purest for chocolate is the cocoa. Chocolate, repeat chocolate. Chocolate. Is the, what is, is what the is the correct guys? With the correct answer? Liquor. Liquor, paste, or neither? Uh -huh. One two, or liquor. three? Liquor. 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 Okay. Okay. Uh, let's see. Uh, we have uh, the last one. Can you read it? Practice your reading with the sentences. Around body. Chocolate. Uh -huh. Chocolate turns to liquid at temperature. Uh, high or a very low or around, similar. Around body and the word temperature. Around, uh -huh. okay, around very high or low. Which one? I'm very high. Very high. Okay, I can select it. Okay. It's already, they are already selected. And I will click on finish to see the answers. Finish. Da, 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 da. Boom. Okay, it says total score is four out of six. Okay, two incorrect answers no this is not the one uh, show answers okay around check body. Uh, it was around um, body temperature yes it didn't say or too high or too low it's around body okay that was number the last one the previous one uh the purest form of chocolate is the cocoa nive. Cocoa nive. What is nive? Cocoa nive. What is nive? Uh huh. Nive can be many translations. Okay, but in this case, because we are talking about cocoa, 
de, de cocoa when you when you grind de, de cocoa lo que sale okay the nib okay good that is great okay and let's see do we have more more things more tasks uh no we don't have more okay okay that was the activity that we have for today about this class uh, checking vocabulary and about verb to be in simple past okay in the readings in the reading parts okay i will send you the listening and in the complete class guys so you can review this topic for vocabulary okay and let's see that was it that was class of 14 uh, see you tomorrow wednesday for the penultimate class of the week okay if you have not completed the platform okay get get ready or hurry a little bit for with the with the sentences and the assignments okay guys you can go you can go already Thank you for being in the class and take care. See you tomorrow. Okay, thank you, Chuck. Night. Great. Thank Have you, a Chuck. great night. Take care a lot. Have a great night. See you. See you. <laughs>